Welcome back to Living Local. The Figgy Art Museum is home to one of the Midwest's finest art collections and hosts world-class traveling exhibitions, art classes, lectures, and special events. The museum is finding creative ways to continue bringing art and people together during these uncertain times. Joining us via Zoom today, we have Tessa Posey. She is with the Figgy Art Museum. Tessa, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. So Tessa, let's first start with Art Off the Wall. What can you tell us about this? So Art Off the Wall is our second biggest fundraiser of the year, which normally we do in person, but this year, of course, we're taking it virtual. It features both original artworks, fine art prints, and 3D objects such as this one. The beautiful Victorian bowl that was donated by Dr. Randy and Linda Lewis has all these beautiful like hand-painted details. So we have a variety of art starting in different pricing from um, for people that are kind of new to collecting art or longtime art collectors. Wow, well that was a ve very beautiful example there, Tessa. If I want to bid on a piece, where do I go to do that? So once the auction opens to the public on December 11th, it'll be accessible from the Figgy's main website under events and programs. But for our members, it will be open early um, and that'll be out through email to them. Easy as that. Now, speaking of members, you're hosting Figgy Member Appreciation Week. Now, can I attend this if I'm not a member? You have to be a member to attend, but the great thing about membership is it's a great way to support arts in the community, and our membership started only $30 per year. So there's a membership that kind of fits every budget, every need um, that is out there. So Member Appreciation Week normally runs the first Thursday to the second Thursday of December. Um, so it'll be the third through tenth this year, and it's just like a way we love to remind our members how much we appreciate their support. They get double discounts in the museum store and the cafe, plus a variety of exclusive events, programs, um, different gifts if they join or renew during that time. Um, and we're also partnering with local uh, neighbors and friends of the museum to provide community partner discounts this year, so you can use your Figgy membership card to get discounts around the community also. That sounds great. A lot of different options for folks. Now, Tessa, with the way things are in the world right now, a lot of people may be curious, okay, is the Figgy open right now? What does it look like to go in if it is open? Can you tell us a little bit more about that? Yeah, so the Figgy is open. We reopened um, our galleries in June, and we're still offering programs towards and more through our virtual museum on our website. So there's both in-person and virtual options. Um, the way that you come to the museum is you can just come normally or reserve online. We also have mandatory masks and social distancing throughout the museum, plus enhanced cleaning um, throughout the day. And Tessa, what can folks expect when they visit the Figgy? So you'll be able to view world-class art in a very safe manner. Um, the Figgy has been putting our visitors and staff safety as top priority this entire time. So we have, you know, very large museum here, so it's very easy to keep spread out and keep everybody safe. Wonderful, and I think we're all looking for opportunities to see beauty and creativity. It really just does enhance your mood so very much. So I'm, I'm so thankful that the Figgy is still finding ways to offer that to our community. Now, Tessa, before we wrap up, can you tell us more about Figgy's Adopt a Painting initiative? Yeah, so this is a great way for the public and our members to get involved in our next major exhibition that's going to be opening in February. That's For America, 200 Years of Painting from the National Academy of Design. So all the works that are coming have been available for adoption at either $250, $500, or $750, depending on the work itself. And available works can be found on our website under the Join and Support category. You'll see the Adopt a Painting category that you can select. Um, they are going quickly, so if this is something people are interested in, I definitely recommend um, looking at those now. Fantastic. Well, Tessa, thank you so much for all the great information and for taking the time to meet with us today. Thank you. For more information, you can visit figgyartmuseum.org. We'll also have those details posted on ourquadcities.com.